The OTC trading goes unregulated until 2024. Over-the-counter trading has been a real issue in our markets. It's allowed financial institutions to trade retail orders outside the late exchanges, NASDAQ, NYSE, making it susceptible to market manipulation. These markets are unregulated, which leads to less public information and the possibility of fraud. Delaying this market reform means the SEC is pushing a decade of complacency since the reform's introduction in 2016, something the SEC is very good at. The question is, though, how long does the SEC think that they can continue to delay market reform before investors take matters into their own hands and into the streets again? I'd love to hear what you guys think down below. Institutions averaged down and increased their position by 32% to 165%. AMC was cheap, so what did you expect? So in the most recent 13F filings on Fintel, we're seeing a lot more information come in with a lot of institutional buying over the past month or so when AMC share price has been suppressed quite a bit. And it doesn't surprise us because a lot of the institutions that have been holding AMC now for a while have a pretty high average cost. So it doesn't surprise me whatsoever that institutions are averaging down. Now, is institutional buying good for AMC? Well, some of us would say yes, but some of us would say not necessarily because institutions most likely borrow out their shares of shorts and basically give the shorts more ammo. Where you and I, as retail investors, can of course go into our brokerage accounts and turn off share lending. And if the retail investors at some point lock the float, then in theory, of course, and of course, in theory, take it with a grain of salt, there'd be no shares to lend out anymore. But regardless, one thing is for certain, the buying is going on from all angles. But if you want to stay up to date with everything else that's going on with AMC, because trust me, guys, there's a lot more to go through. Make sure to please subscribe to my channel with notifications turned on so you never miss out on an up and coming video. Also, if you guys haven't already, make sure to please drop a like on the video. It really helps the channel grow. And lastly, make sure to go down below to my description to see all the links down there. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one.